Hello, I'm Jim Cullerton. I'm the Artistic Director of Fish Amble and Director of Heaven by Eugene O'Brien. And I am Eugene O'Brien and I'm the writer of Heaven. Well, the play Heaven is about a married couple who are back in the um, woman's town to attend her sister's wedding. And so they are a couple who are very fond of each other. They get on really well with each other, but there's huge parts of their inner lives and their true natures that they have not revealed to each other. And during the course of this wedding, uh, over, over this night, um, uh, over these couple of days, a lot of stuff is going to come to the surface. Yeah, I mean, nobody captures kind of life in a small Irish town like Eugene does, really, you know. So this is kind of, you know, a, a fantastic exploration of the relationship between Mal and Maraid, you know, returning home um, to the Midlands, but going through, I suppose, a, a make or break weekend over the course of this, of this wedding. So it's very, it's very specific and evocative and, and truthful to life in this, um, in this small town in the Midlands, and yet, I suppose, because of that, very universal, really. Yeah, and that's always the hope, that the more specific the location is, but you want it to be uh, universal in its themes, you know? And there's lots of great crack in it, and, you know, comedy, because Irish weddings are brilliant to set uh, anything in, because there's a ritual, they're always kind of the same, and so, and all, you know, you're, you're kind of very familiar with the running order of a wedding and the different characters at a wedding and the tensions of a wedding and the kind of madness at a wedding. So, uh, so that's all the kind of the backdrop of, of, of the piece. But really it's about these characters' inner lives. You know, they're, they're, they're kind of, they're, they're facing up to these kind of, you know, um, major kind of revelations or secrets that they haven't told each other, but they tell the audience because that's the kind of play it is. They confide in the audience and tell us. So we're kind of in on, on, the, on the workings of their mind and on their dilemmas and we see what they, what they say about themselves and each other and then how sometimes what they say and, and what they do um, don't quite match up when we start to kind of fill in the gaps ourselves as an audience. I, I wrote the play about two years ago. Uh, it was kind of just before lockdown I started writing it. And it was because my brother took me around the town, uh, uh, my hometown, and we, we drove around the town. And uh, that was kind of made me want to write something about the town again after 20 years. It's the last play I wrote about it. It was called Eden. So it's been a fantastic process. We have a great team of people working on Heaven. Um, Eugene and myself have known each other for so long, really, and I've been uh, spent years hoping that we might get to do a play by Eugene someday. And, um, and over the last few years, we've been working together on the Scripps Festival uh, in Burr, that, um, and that's always been a great experience. So when Eugene sent me a copy of Heaven, I just uh, I thought it was fantastic. I was laughing, uh, I was crying, I cared about Mal and Maraid so much, and the whole world that it conjures up. Um, and then we set about putting together uh, a team. We have a fantastic uh, team of, of um, designers and production and um, the stage management and administrative uh, team uh, on board. So we're delighted at Fish Amble to have such a great team on board. And then to have Janet Moran and Andrew Bennett play the parts uh, is fantastic. Um, we love them. We'd have to say that, obviously, because we're being interviewed. But we actually really do love them, don't we? We think they're we good. Do. I know we do. <laughs> they're fantastic. We just had a first yeah, run yeah. through today here in the rehearsal room. And, uh, and you could tell, I think there's something very, very uh, special about the play, but also yeah. about the performances and hopefully for the experience for the audience. Really. Yeah, yeah. No, they were great, amazing, really. Uh, uh, from my point of view, the script has been amazing because we've kind of done edits, loads of edits, little cuts, little... Uh, rearranging of the script um, and that's been so helpful everyone has been all the suggestions are really good I think you can always never cut enough <laughs> and just get the thing down to the to, to the bone you know and really make it work and everyone's contribution to that has been amazing so uh, I'm, I'm absolutely thrilled and excited I think people will enjoy um, this very authentic kind of portrayal of Irish life and Irish town life. I just be taken on a journey, like it's, a, it's from the word go, you're taken, the story starts up and you're taken on a kind of odyssey through this crazy day and a half, a night of this crazy Irish wedding and these two people who are desperately trying to um, 
be be true to their true selves actually so once the once it kicks off it it, it doesn't stop you know <laughs> it was a great place for kind of i suppose for empathy and seeing the world from someone else's perspective so you get drawn into the world of this couple in their their midlife crisis in the midlands um and then ultimately kind of you know we're, we're drawn into what it means to be alive and to be in a relationship and to what, what to do with all your hopes and dreams and aspirations and worries and regrets and fears and, 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 and to come out the other end of it, you know? It's a little pressure cooker, I suppose, uh, as sometimes mm. when lots of people come together, like over the course of something like a wedding, you know, and lots of family come together, they're, 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 they're things bubble up to the surface and it captures that really well in a way that's really entertaining, a fantastic story, great writing, obviously, and, and two um, really wonderful performances kind of bring yeah. it to life, you know? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, two brilliant, brilliant actors. Uh, so that's definitely worth uh, coming along to see.